from Louisiana's home team. This is Fox 8 News at 8 a.m. 825 a.m. now with Thanksgiving just around the corner. Many of us are looking forward to spending time with our families. But some aren't able to do that because they are serving our country overseas. This morning we are joined live via satellite by a local mar Marine who is currently serving in the Middle East. And let's warn you, there is a little bit delay before he hears our question and then he answers back. But let's welcome now Lance Corporal Garrett Dugan. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Good. We are doing well. How long have you been deployed overseas, and are you in Afghanistan? Uh, yes, ma'am. I'm currently on uh, Camp Leatherneck, Afghanistan. We've been here for just over three months. And, Corporal, uh, do you know when you're going to be able to come home? And uh, what are your thoughts about home as, uh, as you head into the holidays in Afghanistan? Um, we will be getting back uh, towards the end of February, and um, the holidays are always a hard time, but being in the military, you kind of get used to it. I have a second family out here. And thank you so much for your service. We want to stress this to you as we talk to you here. Um, how will you be celebrating Thanksgiving? You can't be here for the gumbo or all of the other great things, the oyster uh, dressing. What will you be doing there? Um, myself and uh, the other people from my division, we uh, take a big kind of field trip down to one of the big uh, chow halls and we'll celebrate dinner together as a family out here. And Corporal, I know that um, Skype has become a, a part of a, of, of a soldier's uh, itinerary uh, when serving overseas. Are you able to talk with your family at all while, while you're deployed there? Will, will you be visiting with them on Skype or, or calling them? Uh, yes, I will, actually. I'll be setting up a time so I can speak with my sister, my family. They'll all be together having family, having dinner, and also with my girlfriend and her family. And when people send care packages to troops overseas during the holidays, how much does that mean to, to folks like yourself when you're over there on the front line risking your lives for us? How much does that mean to you guys? It's actually a really big deal to us out here. Um, it's not like we can go, you know, on our own and go get certain things. You know, when they send us, you know, um, Christmas stockings or they send us canned yams even, something as simple as that, it's, it's actually a really big thing because we know that they care about us. Corporal, how long have you been in the Marines? And is there any special message you want to send to your uh, friends and loved ones? Um, I've been in the Marines for a little over uh, two and a half years now, and I just want to say that, you know, I love you and miss you to all my family, my girlfriend, my friends at home, um, that I'll definitely miss them during this holiday. <laughs> if there's anything, my last question to you, that they can send from Lacoma, from Louisiana, that you miss, what would you like? Uh, Melaton dressing would be about the only thing I could miss for uh, this holiday. Good call. Uh, I'm sure there's a way to get that to him with a, a, some sort of frozen container through FedEx, but uh, I'm sure somebody will be stepping up to get that to you. Uh, Corporal Garrett Dugan from Lacombe, thank you very much for your service there, sir, and uh, have a happy Thanksgiving. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you so much, Lance Corporal. And mixing out the fog this morning, mostly cloudy, warm, and humid.